Odoo has a well-structured pipeline to keep control of your opportunities. So you can get an overall view of your opportunities. And this pipeline is a visual representation and it refers to the process by which you generate, qualify and close leads through your sales cycle. So from the CRM module, you can view and manage opportunities from the pipeline shown by default in the Kanban view. Opportunities can also be managed in different other views. Like here we can switch to different views like list view, then calendar view. We have pivot view, graph view, cohort view, then dashboard view. So from this pipeline, uh, from this Kanban view, you can see that uh, there are different stages like new qualified proposition one. So the opportunity goes through these stages and finally, it reaches the one stage. So when an opportunity reaches the one stage, then we can establish a business deal with the customer. So whenever you create a new opportunity, either from the pipeline, or uh, if you have created from lead by converting lead to opportunity, then that opportunities are bought at the left end of the sales pipeline in the Kanban view and then move along to the right from one stage to another. Uh, like if you try to create an opportunity from here by setting the contact, opportunity name, then email, phone number, expected revenue. And when you click on add, you can see that opportunity is added to the new stage. Then if it is qualified, you can move to qualified. And the same way, you can see if you have a lead here. And when you convert this lead to opportunity, Now, when you check the opportunity pipeline, you can see that opportunity is added to the pipeline. Then you can view opportunity details by clicking on it. And you can click on edit to edit the details. Or here we have an option to edit opportunity. And you can also set a color for your opportunity. Here you can set color to identify it. And from a pipeline, you can also calculate, that is, you can also estimate the expected revenue from each stage. So here for under new stage, you can see uh, 104K is expected revenue. And for qualified stage, you can see it is 95,084. Like this way, for each stage, you can view the expected revenue. So here, for this opportunity pricing for 25 desk, let me set an expected revenue 10,000. Now you can see if I come back, for the stage new, the expected revenue is updated. And when you change the stage, you can also view the probability will be updated. Like here, if I change uh, the stage of this opportunity from qualified to proposition, you can see the probability calculated by Odo is updated here. Now it is updated as 99.78. And if you want to switch to automatic probability, you can just click on this. So you can see the probability is updated for this opportunity. Then Odo also allows us to schedule activities from the opportunity pipeline.
so you can follow the customers through emails phone calls or conference so after choosing the activity type you can set the summary for your activity then you can set due date then you can assign to a user and after providing the log node you can schedule activity and we can also keep track of those activities uh, by looking at the stage so you can view the count of activities and you can view the status of activities by looking at the colors and you can click on that to view those activities here we have one overview and one activity for today and one plan activity and you can see for this opportunity no activities scheduled and it's possible to delete an opportunity from the pipeline so here we can use delete and you can see that opportunity is deleted and according to that you can see the change in expected revenue and we have also got a lot of filtering and grouping options so if you want to uh, filter out one opportunities or lost opportunities then if you want to view unassigned opportunities and you can also view open opportunities you can filter opportunities by creation date close date and you can also group these opportunities by sales person here you can view opportunities assigned to michel admin so if i close my pipeline you can view we have mark demo so these are the opportunities assigned to mark demo and you can also group them by sales team then stage city country so you can view these are the opportunities from country australia and here we have this much opportunities from belgium the same way we can group by creation date conversion date expected closing date close date so crm pipeline feature is really helpful to track what's happening with your opportunity sales and makes your sales team more efficient